Okay, we're here with Butch Williams, the Access Control Manager at Clark Security Products San Diego branch. Hi, Butch. Hi. And today, Butch is going to show us how to install these really cool ICM, Butch? ICM Corporation uh, compression fittings for CCTV. Great. Um, first of all, we have the, the actual ICM stripper, which is part number 413155. Next we have the actual compression tool, which is uh, easy number 417097. And then lastly, we have the actual, uh, it's a RG59 compression uh, BNC connector. I'm going to try and zoom up really close on that okay. one, Butch, so it's just great. Good shot. Thank you. Okay, show us how they go together. Okay. First, uh, we have a piece of regular Siamese cable here. What you want to do is you want to strip the actual cable, the uh, power cable from the actual video cable, and that's usually just pulling it apart. Just with your fingers? Just with your fingers. Okay. Um, then you want to take the actual stripper itself, and you want to go ahead and uh, strip it onto the wire, strip back the wire. Okay, and how does that go on the wire now? There is actually a little hole on the side here. Okay. And you place the wire into the actual... Um, that oh, I see, it opens up like that, okay. Into the, into the hole. Great. So, like so. Okay. Give it a quick, good squeeze. And then just do a couple turns this way, a few turns that way, and it should just pop right off. And that's what you have for a finished product. And that com is completely prepared now for... For, uh, for a fitting. Let's see if we can get the camera to focus for okay. us. Okay. There we go. Sorry if I'm making you sick, folks. No. Okay, and we'll back off now so you can show us the rest of the process. Okay. You want to just get the braiding away from the actual core of the, the wire. Uh huh. Then you want to take your RG59 fit, fitting connector, place it down on top. So that just pushes into the back of the connector? Just pushes down. So you just push it straight down. Now the cable that you're using, does it matter whether it's plenum or non-plenum rated cable? No, these fitting these connectors will work for both uh, plenum or non-plenum wire. Okay. Push it down and then the pin will pop out of the top of the connector. Okay, let's see the end of the connector now to see the... Oops, I lost you. Oops, sorry. Just hold still there. I zoom way up on that. Okay, go ahead. And then it comes out. So then what you want to do is you want to take your actual compression tool. Um, you have two little handles right here. Mm -hmm. and pull them back. Okay. Place the wire down through the top into the little catch. It just pushes, pushes in there, huh? Yes. Wow. That should just set right in there. Sorry about that. There you go. Just sets right into the little catch. Okay. Um, and then all you want to do is then just squeeze. And you just squeeze it until it's up there to the very top. And it's complete. And then how do we get it out of the uh, tool? Take the two uh, release handles up on top. Uh huh. Release them and just pull it straight out. Wow. Now that's a very secure connector. That's. Is, would you say that that's a more secure connector than the traditional yeah. sort of crimp connectors? This is, uh, this takes 60 pounds of, uh, 60 pounds of, uh, pull to pull this thing off the end of the wire. Which is hopefully more than you're going to get on a CCTV system. Okay, and I can see the end of the connector there and looks really clean, looks factory. All right, so that has been a CCTV connector installation with Butch Williams, the access control manager at Clark Security Products San Diego branch. Uh, if you want to learn more about these products, you can see them on our website at www.clarksecurityproducts, no, clarksecurity.com, www.clarksecurity.com. Thanks.